I look like trash and sound like trash is because I feel like trash. <laughs> I am very sick. But I told myself I wasn't going to stop, so here I am. And today's video, it is <clears throat> Vintage Day 13. Ooh. Um, and I'm going to talk about another beauty box that I got this week. And this time, it's going to be about Allure. The Allure beauty box. For those of you who don't know, Allure is a magazine. And they always tend to do the um, best of beauty kind of thing like Allure puts like a stamp of best of beauty to a lot of products and you know because Allure magazine you know that gives the products clout as the kids say uh, <laughs> so it makes sense for them to have a subscription box and I like Allure a lot because they put a lot of products that they themselves have deemed very good or excellent or the best of the best so <clears throat> you're going to find a lot of high-end uh, products on these boxes they tend to vary between sample sizes and uh, full sizes uh, last month they did a collaboration with Jaclyn Hill look how cute and they come with like a little magazine which is really cute and it just gives you information of the products that come inside um, so that's really cool. Uh, so the subscription for Allure, um, you start off the first month when you first subscribe, you pay, you pay $10 and then after that is $15 every month. Personally, I think it's worth it. I believe from the ones that I received, this is the second most expensive. The first one being BoxyCharm, then it's Allure, and then it's the other three that I received. Um, but I personally believe that this, that is worth it because you get really good products so we're just gonna jump into that so this is a little magazine that comes uh, in the box this month Allure Beauty Box exclusive promo codes inside Ooh. and we're just gonna go through the products uh, very quickly so the first thing that came in that I'm really excited about it this is the, the full they sent in a full product this time and it is from Sunday Riley it is their CEO serum it's called the Sunday Riley CEO uh, Rapid Flash Serum. I love Sunday Riley, but they are pricey. But oh man, are they good. I dropped this box, and I think I might have dropped the cap for this. I'm not sure. So <clears throat> this one here, it says in the, in the pamphlet, it is $85. Holy shit let me show you that again so you can see what it what it brings it is 50% uh, tetrahexyl this oh sure uh, the gold standard of vitamin C to rapidly brighten the appearance of the skin and boost vital skin bounce in a flash uh, CEO rapid flash brightening serum rich and powerful stable vitamin C is targeted to quickly fight the visible signs of dullness mm -hmm. dark spots and discolorations at the source while diminishing the first signs of aging of aging brighten uh, what brightens and illuminates the skin instantly while 50% of that chemical that I couldn't pronounce uh, Uh, the gold standard of the vitamin C rapidly engages the root causes of an even tone and visibly connects corrects to look of skin the look of skin oh, I can't see this colorations uh, brighter and brighter. anyway so vitamin C essentially what it does is that it brightens your skin um, and it get it takes away discoloration I personally don't have a lot of discoloration I don't well, I don't know if the under eyes is considered discoloration. I'm not sure, but you, I don't really think you can put this under your eyes anyways. But my skin, I don't really have an even skin tone. I just do have dullness uh, because of my dry skin and obviously some age lines because hmm, your girl was not... She, <laughs> she got dropped from the tree a while ago. <laughs> um, I don't know what that means. Oh, and it smells... 
it smells like oranges. Anything that has vitamin C is normally gonna smell like oranges. This is so good for the morning time when you wanna give yourself a little pep, a little spritz to start off the day. You put this on, put on your moisturizer, let it sit for like a minute or two so that your skin could absorb it and then continue with your makeup routine and you'll be Gucci. So I'm so excited that this came in the box. All right, so next product we have is from This Works. Let me get that because, again, I dropped this box on the floor. Here we go. So the rest of the products that, uh, that come in here are now going to be uh, sample sizes. So this is from the brand This Works, and it's called the In Transit Camera Close-Up. So this is a mask, moisturizer, and primer in one. What? That is crazy. I've never heard of that before. I've heard of this brand, This Works. Uh, pretty good skincare. So, uh, the pr original price of that product is $55. Mm -hmm. um, you can buy it at their website, thisworks.com. And um, they, this little thing gives you a promo code so you can be able to. Uh, get 20% off so that's not bad so this is very interesting this says um, apply to skin and massage until absorb oh and that's it so you apply this to your skin like a mask massage it and then it just stays on and you can put your makeup on top of this that's very interesting oh <laughs> it's sealed as it should be let me see if it has any kind of distinctive smell. Well, I mean, I don't even know why I'm trying because I am so congested, as I'm sure you can hear from my voice. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely excited to try that because it sounds very interesting. So next we have a Frederick Fikai product. And it's called the one and this is a one and then some dry texturing spray so this this right here again another sample size oops um, then the price the original price for this is $29 you can purchase it at fakai.com again they got they give you another uh, discount code if you want to purchase anything from their website this isn't so uh texturizing sprays are not the same as dry shampoos this is for like for example me i have very thin hair and because i have thin hair it just lies flat on my face i don't have any volume so right after i blow dry my hair or i straighten it because that's normally what i do um, it doesn't have any volume and normally if I were to curl my hair right after I, I straighten it It wouldn't the, the curl wouldn't hold because it's too fresh or too clean. I'm not sure how that works There's no texture on it so um, This I would use this so then I would spray this on my hair, you know, give it a good shoes and Then take the curling iron and it would hold up the curl or I could just you know use it to give it volume it says, uh, shake it up, holding the bottle six to ten inches away from hair, mist from roots to ends. For ultimate volume, flip hair upside down and spray. You know, I've never used a Frederick Fakai product, so I'm not sure if, if this is going to be the same with this. I'll definitely use it, but I have never found a, a, a spray <clears throat> that... When I do that, when I like flip my hair and do the whole thing and then flip it back, like at the moment it looks okay, it looks with volume because on it, obviously I just did that. But once I kind of like style it, it just goes back to how it looked. So, and then my hair is just left feeling dirty and heavy. So, um, yeah. <laughs> but we'll see what this one works because Frederick Fakai is a really, really, really good brand. Next, we have another sample size. This is from Makeup Forever, and it is the Artist Liquid Matte Lipstick in Rosewood. Ooh, Rosewood. So, oh, this is so cute. So this is what this looks like. That's the color, Rosewood. Um, 
I love having these little things because I just put this on my makeup bag in my purse and then whenever I go out and if I forget to put on a lip color or if I'm going somewhere and you know I need to reapply this is good so the original price for this is uh, $20 they have it at Sephora and again another promo code but I wonder if I can use this at the Sephora website. Hmm. Interesting. Um, but yeah, I love Makeup Forever. Oh. Yes. It's one of those liquid lipsticks that taste like pastries, that smell like pastry. Don't taste it. <laughs> um, I have never used Makeup Forever's li uh, liquid lipsticks, though. So I am very excited to try that. Um... Oh, let me swatch the color. How about that? <laughs> such a great YouTuber. Ooh, this is such a nice color. It's like a mauve pink. It has like brown undertones. Hope you can see that because it's light. Oh, there we go. These are the kind of colors that I love. I love a good mauve pink brown color. It just looks so nice on me because it's kind of like a dark nude for me. Last but not least, we have, um, oh, well, I guess this is another, uh, this would be another full size because it's a pencil. This is from Rodial and it is a smoky eye pen. This is um, $21. Rodial is a British... A British beauty brand oh and it has one of these annoying paper things why do people do this why it's just the worst <laughs> um, did I mention it's $21 already yes and you can get it at rodile.co.uk again they have another um, code here okay so let me see off and this is supposed to be in the color brown I love brown eyeliners um, I tend to this is the color right here I tend to um, gravitate towards brown a lot more than I do for black especially for those days where I want some definition in my eyes but I'm not looking to look too intense like if you like to eyeline your eyes um, or if you feel like you like to have some definition in your eyes but you don't want to look crazy like for work it's early in the morning you're not trying to look like panda eyes brown is the best and brown um, will still give you that little that glam look without looking too intense um, so I really like that I did mention before that I haven't had a lot of good luck when it comes to eye pencils like these, especially on my on my uh, on my, on my waterline, because I have very sensitive eyes and they water just at the mention of watering, like right now. <laughs> um, you know, when I laugh, when I yawn, when I blink too much, water works. It's insane. So I haven't found something that can actually work against like tears because they say waterproof but I mean after you do your makeup how often do you splash your face with actual water like <laughs> but I need something that is tear proof so beauty industry I'm calling you out where is my tear proof water eye liner um, but I will definitely try this out um, because as of right now the only brown that I've been using is from MAC, the Costa Riche uh, eyeliner, which I love. I love Costa Riche. I love that color. So let's see how this works out. Those are the products that I've received in this month's box of Allure. Let me know um, which box you have. You guys have enjoyed the most so far. Um, as of right now, the number one contender, and which normally it is, is BoxyCharm because you get full full sizes of really great products but Allure is definitely a really close second because you know that you're gonna get quality products even if it's uh, 
even if it is just a sample size, you are going to get good quality products and it's a pretty good price. I mean, $15 is not, it's not bad. All these things, the full price of, with the full price of everything, if you were to purchase everything, would be almost $200. So, you know, you're saving yourself a lot of money and you're getting yourself a lot of good products. So, I think it's worth it. Um, let me know what you guys think and thank you so much for sticking around and I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. Bye.